Here we have another example which says we should construct a graph of this linear equation 3y plus 3 equals to 6x. Remember, whenever you are given an equation in this form to construct a graph, all you have to do is to transform the equation into slope and intercept form, which is y equals to mx plus c. This y is the function. This is uh, slope m and this is uh, the intercept which is the value of y when x is set to be equal to 0. So we need to transform this equation into this form 3y plus 3 equals to 6x. We need to take this constant term to the right hand side so we have 3y to be equal to 6x minus 3 because initially it was positive. Then we divide both sides by 3 since we only need y to be along at the left hand side. So we divide both sides by 3. By 3. So here we have only y and 6 divided by 3 is 2x then minus 1. So here slope is our slope is equals to 2 which is the coefficient of x and the c which is the intercept is negative 1 from here. But remember, slope is always rational, so it is going to be 2 divided by 1. And 2 divided by 1 is the same thing as 2. So these are the two, two terms we need in order to float our graph. So our graph is going to look like this. This is y axis, while this is x axis. Remember to always plot the intercept first, which is the value of uh, y when x is equal to 0 and it is along y-axis so from the origin this is negative one this is negative one so this is our uh, intercept while the slope is two divided by one this means you go up two times then this one you go down you go to the left right so you go to the you go to the right one time so from here we go off twice one two then you go to the right one this is one this is one so you need to use your ruler to connect these two dots together these are the two dots you need to connect together so this is a straight line graph of the form of the equation three y plus three equals to six x so this is exactly how to flood a graph of linear equations.